Hi, I'm Greer Wilder with Greer's SCTV. Tonight, we're at the Big Newport Edwards Theater for the opening night of the Newport Beach Film Festival. Well, I think what I'm really most excited about is just the great quality of film that we have at the film festival. I mean, it's been a hallmark since we started, but especially this year, we have over 360 films from over 47 countries. You know, we've got 17 special events throughout the run of the festival, and really there's something for everyone. So if, if people are sitting back going, gosh, what are we gonna do this week? Literally, there is something really cool going on every day at the Newport Beach Film Festival. It's such a great thing to be a part of the film that's opening the festival tonight. It's really an honor to be asked to come, and we're very excited to be here. Yeah, and I think, you know, when you're doing independent films, sometimes you don't know if you're going to get acknowledged. So the fact that it was acknowledged in kind of a really big way is yes. really, is really, you know, it's a great really nice. feeling. Yeah. It's wonderful to be a part of all of it. I wanted to ask you, you're in the OC, what is it like to be back in the real OC? Back in the OC, you know, driving up Jamboree, I just thought, oh man, memories, memories. Right. But it's, uh, it's, it's good to be back. What are you working on now? Um, right now, I'm nothing. I just finished up a movie called Burlesque with uh, Christina Aguilera and Cher, which will be uh, entertaining, if anything. And uh, yeah, after that I got nothing, so I'm here to find a job. Uh, five Star Day, I play a single parent uh, who's struggling with a custody battle. And um, I meet someone in sort of an off chance circumstance and um, connection ensues. And it's uh, sort of broadly based around astrology and um, this one character's sort of quest of disproving um, that astrology doesn't really exist. And what about you? Do you believe in astrology? Uh, I, d I mean, it's funny. It's like, do you believe in cereal? Like, I understand it exists. You know, it doesn't mean that I necessarily have to eat it. I like to find the healthiest kind, the one that works for me. Um, but on a broad scheme, mm, probably not. Probably not. Went to high school in Huntington Beach, yeah. Uh, we lived in Chicago until junior high school. We moved out to Huntington Beach, and I went to the high school at Marina High School in Huntington Beach. So. And this is your first feature film yes, first where you, you, did, you did it all. <laughs> I don't know about Pretty doing much. it all. No, you well, know, well, really. writer director, you know, right. so I'm one of the producers on the project, so it was, uh, it was awesome. And how, was, how does it feel to be here tonight? Uh, I don't, but please pinch me if this is not real, really, because. Uh, yeah, your film was chosen. To yeah, I, I, I can't yeah. believe it. Still, I, when I got the call a couple of weeks ago, I don't think I've stopped smiling yet. You know, oh, I'm really so trying exciting. to. I never in a million years. I was so excited to be the. We originally were supposed to be, I think, Friday at like six o'clock, is what I was told. And so then when we got the phone call that we were the opening night, I was excited to be just in the festival, let alone being this. So is. What would you say for people that are interested in getting into film? What tips would you give them? Uh, work hard. <laughs> Uh, really, that would be the hard uh, tenacity has been the one thing. Literally, an hour and a half ago, I was in that booth making sure the film was good while everybody was, and I had a hat on and I had my t shirt on. I just snuck in the back, but that's the dedication I think that really it takes to, to make it happen. So. so, that's a look at the world premiere of Five Star Day, which kicks off the Newport Beach Film Festival running through April 29th. Thank you for watching Career Associate TV. See you next time.